Hello everybody and welcome back to the Mega Modded series. We are jumping in again for another run. Our streak is looking pretty dire right now. I don't know why that's up there. Let's just do another reroll. Isaac, no thank you. Maggie, let's do a little Maggie run. Maggie, you can be a fun one. Uh, I don't think we, yeah, we don't, haven't got any completion marks with Maggie yet. It's our first Maggie run. We'll see if we can do a sack room play on floor one. Um, it's always a pleasure to do so, so I'll try it. But yes, um, I'm jumping in after a little bit of a hiatus from Isaac, uh, which is weird for me. I had a four day break from Isaac because my girlfriend's parents were over because it was her mother's birthday and we went on a little adventure park sort of holiday thing. I say adventure park, it was like a three hour, four hour little thing where we went and did uh, axe throwing and quad biking. It was a lot of fun, but it meant they were over the week for the weekends I couldn't record. And so I had a little, break, a little bit of a refresh break from Isaac, so I do apologize if my skill is uh, is lacking somewhat. If my skill is leaving a li little bit to be desired. I do not like this guy being a champion. Uh, if it leaves a little bit to be desired... Oh, doesn't matter. <laughs> he killed himself. If it leaves a bit to be desired, I apologize. But otherwise, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm good to get back into it. And as well, just on the topic of... For the question of the day, what is... um. What is the most adventurous thing you've done? I know some of you might be like introverts or might not do anything that adventurous really, but out of the things you have done, what would you say is the thing that you've done that's most adventurous? Because I've done quite a lot, to be honest. Um, luckily for me, I've got another full health pill here. If this guy could crack that open, that would be kind of nice. Don't get hit. Oh, God. I was about to say we're getting hit here. This guy won't die. Okay, there you go. So we've got another full health pill in case we need it. I'll take that as well. That's a half pill. Um, I'll pop that real quick. Come on, sack room. Give us a sack room. Come on. You know you want to. Um, yeah, I've actually been quite lucky because even though my parents weren't, weren't super well off, we used to go abroad like once a year. So I've been to Egypt a few times, um, which I know isn't like a super common holiday destination. But yeah, I've been to Egypt a few times, which has been really nice. Um, and there I got to do some adventurous things. I haven't done anything crazy like skydiving or anything. Also, this is a pretty horrendous room for us. Um, I haven't done anything crazy like skydiving or anything, but I have, um, I've like swam in the Red Sea and been like scuba diving and snorkeling and stuff um, in Egypt, which was really cool because the, 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 the ocean life there is just insane. It's just like you, you literally walk into the sea and there's just fish of all colors and coral of all colors everywhere around you. It's beautiful. Um, so that was really nice. And we went like on a glass bottom boat and stuff like that. And like I said, went to the Dead Sea, Red Sea, whatever you want to call it, either way. That was really cool as well. Um, but other than that, I haven't really done anything super crazy. I've been to a few different places that do like zip lining and like the high jump stuff and all that sort of all that sort of good stuff, but nothing really super crazy. Um, this axe throwing and um, and de um, like dirt biking uh, was real, not dirt biking, um, quad biking, sorry. Was, was really, really good. That that was pretty interesting. And I ended up being a lot better at both than I thought I'd be. Like, I can't drive, so I didn't know how I'd do at quad biking. Ended up being pretty good at it. And it was like a really bumpy sort of dirty course they took us on. Um, so it was kind of a lot to go through, but it was it was really good. Um, I'm going to go through to the cash room real quick here. And see what we can get out of it. Nothing. And I'll grab this heart. I'm, I think I'm going to take the black hole, you know. I th a yum heart is good, but the black hole is actually extremely strong in my opinion. It can destroy rocks because like, so for example, we don't have to do it now, but if we wanted, in fact, I think I am going to do it, you know, if we wanted all of this, we could get all of this. Like, look at that. That's so useful. I realize we, did, we now don't have it for the boss, but the radius at which it destroys things is kind of crazy. Um, let's keep her going. We've got this fella. Ooh, I've taken a very, very ill-advised path here. What the hell? I walked right over the creep and didn't get hit. I'm so glad I got a speed upgrade earlier. I very, very desperately needed it. Um, but yeah, so the, the, I ended up being really good at the axe throwing. Um, I went with my girlfriend and her parents, and out, out of the four of us, her, her dad was really good at it, but I think I was also, like, I was staying on par, to be honest. And I, I really didn't think I would be. Um, spawns. Ooh, this is actually kind of good. Look at that. That's incredible. I'm taking all the pills here. Health up. Baby, things are looking good. Uh, I'm going to go check out the shop real quick. There's a chance that we could get some extra stuff from it. And yeah, I, I'm kind of I'm kind of tempted. 
Hmm. I'm going to plant a bomb here and see if we can get two pennies. Because the it's kind of common to get two pennies from these. There you go. Exactly like that. And I was about to say, if I do get two pennies, then I'll take this fella. Otherwise, I was going to buy the scratch card. Um, but I do like having um, our little buddy with us. Let's keep going. So we can go down any path we want this time around. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty tempted to go mother, I'll be honest. I got a lot of keys this floor, and I haven't been mother in a while. As much as mother doesn't give you as many completion marks, this is a regular character where we're not going for, us, for uh, any unlocks. Because it's only modded or tainted ones that we get unlocks for, really. So it's kind of like, I'm a bit more okay with it, to be honest. Okay, keep these guys at arm's length here. I don't know what our buddy's doing right now, but he does not have a great setup. He is, uh, I think he's firing really low-range tiny planet. By the looks of it. Okay, no. I thought the spikes would come back up. Bit more money for us there. But yeah, it was it was really nice to have a break from recording and Isaac, but also just uh, do some do some stuff I hadn't done before. I ended up liking the quad biking so much more than I thought it would. I was kind of nervous for it actually, just because I thought it'd be a bit stressful, a bit difficult. I didn't know how good I'd be at it, but I ended up loving it. I was like absolutely revving the thing and just going full speed um, up some of these courses, and it's kind it's kind of it is kind of scary because like. You're going like really, really fast um, up these up these different like small hills with like rocks and all that sort of stuff all over it, and the bumps do make you bounce off the seat and kind of let go of the steering a little bit. So it is a little nerve wracking, but at the same time, it's a lot of fun. It was it was a lot, a lot of fun. I need to get rid of this frog guy. He's uh, seems like he's going to be a problem. Stop farting on me, fella! Stop farting on me, fella, Stan. Okay, take care of these dudes. Ooh, give us a key. Damn it, no key. But yeah, it's, it's definitely interesting to hear what um, what you guys have done that's adventurous. Even if it's not something that's like actually like really adventurous, just something that's like well outside of your comfort zone. Um, chance to teleport to the devil room and taking damage. That sounds awesome. Um, although a friendly dip on picking up coins is like really good too. I'll take this one, just because it could end up being really good. I don't know what's going to be better. The dips are probably a bit more defensively use useful, but I kind of like the idea more of being teleported to a devil deal every now and again. The only problem I foresee is maybe it'll teleport to devil deals we don't want to be in. By the way, I love the flowing locks of our Maggie babies. They are so cute. We do have a sack room this floor. Right, how many players have we got here? Let me, let me figure this out. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, I actually think we should do this. Ooh, also, great item there. Although piercing would have been just as good. Uh, I think we do this. I think we go... This could also make this even more viable. Give us some hearts, please. Give us a... Two of diamonds... Which I think I'll honestly just use now. Uh, so we go one, two. Now I didn't expect that, I'll be honest. Um, mm, I'm going to say no to that. Probably should have dropped the trinket first, right? Three. I'm going to drop it now just in case. Four. Nice. A joker. Five. Six. Devil teleport again. <laughs> Do I actually want any of this? The abyss bombs are really good. I'll take the Abyss Bombs. They're really good. And then just a Soul Heart. Get out of the way, Pill. Tears down! You kidding me? I need to do, like, two more plays to get the big payout, so it's kind of, like, not really worth it. Right, uh... I, I'm, I don't know whether I'm happy about taking Devil Deal there. That might not have been a great choice. I'm just going to check this again. Mm. 
Okay. I didn't expect that to work, but it does. Um, and then bomb you. I don't actually know what the upgrades for this guy do. Uh, encyclopedia, inventory. Let's have a little look see, shall we? Upgrades. Gains a random additional to your effect. Additional to your effects can be Ipecac, unless Ipecac is the base attack of the buddy. Oh, can't be. Uh, gain another random to your effect. Okay, so we just got a ton of random to your effects on this dude. Um, and do you know what? This will give us some locusts, so let's just blow these up anyways. Okay. Yeah, I'm, I'm reasonably happy with how that worked out. Wasn't really planning on going Devil Deal, but we're there now. Min Min, you are about to get absolutely shifty shat on. And then we take this heart first. Grab that. That was not a wise choice, was it? Um, it's okay, it's okay. Just grab it. I, I'm, I'll probably end up losing my, well, no, I will lose my burn heart to do this, but I think this is worthwhile. I'm going to go back and play the sack room a little bit more to try and get to that seven soul heart or a lot of money drop. Damn, that was bad. That has wasted some time for us here. Ah, we got the penny drop. I mean, the penny drop's still pretty good. But it's not really what I was hoping for. Okay. Let's go. Wait, wasn't there, um, there's options in the shop? Or more options, sorry. More options, yeah, we'll take that. And do you know what? For three cent, I'll grab the heart as well, just in case. This is going pretty well. Uh, secret room is almost definitely here as well. We have the bombs for it. It's not, wow. I was proven incorrect. Probably here then, right? What? <laughs> what the deuce? Honestly, considering this is just building up locusts for us, I'm just going to keep trying. Ooh, that's nice. That's nice. Better health from a cardboard box. Would you not eat a meal you found in a cardboard box? How dare you? And down we go. Okay, we have to do the mirror puzzle next time, so let's not forget that. These locusts are going to pretty much take care of this whole room for us. Honestly, our little buddy is going to be doing so many tier effects now as well. He's got like... I think he starts off with like two or three, and he's got plus an additional two. Or three, even. I don't know how many he's got to bonus, but he's going to be firing off a lot of different tier effects for us and doing us a very good service. So I... Do not dislike him. Let, let me out. Oh, you're still alive. Hello. Did not know that. Did not know that. But yeah, you look at all the different stuff that he's firing off. It's crazy. Um, I think I will take sibling rivalry here. Flatstone would have also been fun. But sibling rivalry is pretty good. I'm going to gamble and say here. Damn it. This also does save as a key, though, so it's fine. Nothing too relevant there. Do not push, you bastard. I mean, we got the Keeper's Rope, so can't be too sad. But could you not fight right now, guys? Grant's Flight, minus two uh, look down if not playing as the Keeper or taking the Keeper. When monsters spawn, they have a 25% chance to contain one to three pennies, which can be extracted by damaging them. Um... Interesting, okay. Gives us flight as well, so I'm pretty happy about that. Also makes us look funky. And Deep Pockets is a great addition. I like it. Okay, I've got some good stuff going on here. I'm very happy with this setup now. And our character's looking rather funkalicious too. Which I definitely appreciate. So there's, there's our mirror room. I love sibling rivalry as an item. It's one of my it's one of my favorite like items that I feel is just completely thematic and fitting with the game. 
It just works so well. But yeah, we are going to get a lot of money. Although I did just realize that we lost some of that money from the Keeper's thingy there. Which I didn't know was going to happen. I will play this a little. Doesn't matter. I'll play it once. Range down for a damage up. Hell to the yes. Okay, okay, we can see which enemy contains the pennies. And then pennies slowly fade. Do you know what I've forgotten about here? I've forgotten to save my bombs, haven't I? I really need to save bombs here, didn't I? I really need to save bombs and I didn't. I don't know, we're getting explosive tears out though. There's a chance. There's one bomb. There's a tinted drop right there. Oh wait, does... Does the uh, black hole open up the door, I wonder? I guess I'll have to try that out if, if we don't get the bombs. Calm down. That didn't that didn't go anywhere near to where I wanted to throw that. Also, it's looking like a big fat no. Okay. Let's go collect our stuff. Where do we want to place this exactly? Let's go here, maybe. There you go. Cracked. Beautiful. Cracked key. Ow. Oh, and there's the bomb. Awesome. Saves us some hassle. Ooh, it's Sister Maggie. I can't believe we got so lucky. I'm so glad we spent the extra effort to try and find that room. <laughs> Beautiful. Very happy with that fire rate right now. Very happy indeed. Don't keep firing into that mirror because that could screw us so hard. We only have to go across a few rooms here to get to where we want to be. This guy's going to end up firing off some crazy crazy tears at enemies, so... Oh god, that guy kind of came out of nowhere. Here's one of the penny dudes. Grab it. We've got split shots and all sorts. There's just crazy stuff going on right now. We need a BFF. BFF will be top tier right now. And we got another bomb as well, so we can open this into draw. Good, good. Hell yeah, I'll open that up. Quite a lot of pennies we have here. There's a tinted rock in here too. Oh, this is putting our health in a beautiful position. What boss did we fight again? I don't remember. I feel like whatever it was, we handled it really easily. Oh, we did have... um. We did have the Azazel thing, though, so it won't be as easy this time. But I still think with Black Hole, we can easily kill this dude without getting hit. I just lost my Holy Mantle. Be very, very careful. I did not realize I was about to lose it there. Yeah, I think, I think with this setup... With the black hole and everything. Ooh, he does move out of the black hole. But it doesn't matter. He's dead anyways. Oh, yes. We got Apology too. This this item needs a nerf very soon. Right, back we go. Yeah, Apology, if you haven't seen it already, after we get a kill, we get an insane tears upgrade that... Fades quickly over time, in quotation marks, meaning it fades incredibly slowly over time. <laughs> but we've we've just set ourselves up for a very good run here. Um, everything about this has gone nice and well. Will that hit the tinted rock? Nope. Dumbass. It's okay though, because we get locusts. Mr. Bomb's just a more locusts for us. That works for me. I will take the Rotten Hearts, I think. Yeah, look at that. Huge tears bonus. And it goes over the cap, too. Let's not forget it goes over the cap. Right. 
Take care of that. Get an alarming amount of white locusts from this setup. An alarming amount. I will check this out considering our key situation. All pickups and trinkets. Ah, oh, that was that was a bit, a bit useless, that wasn't it? Addicted gives us a black heart. Health health down for a damage up is kind of okay, to be honest. I don't particularly need all the health right now, but I don't know. I'll stick with what I've got going on. I wonder, can these dudes give me lucky pennies and stuff? Probably not, right? We got... Luck decreases accuracy, look up. I'm just going to take the random. And I'm glad that I did. I love this item. The, 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 the bar, the little like, bar to tell you it's ready is so fucking cool. And the, just the, the sound effects and everything. This thing just, it just feels great to use. Oh, I don't know if you heard that then, but the da 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 of you picking up the coins fit perfectly in line with the music. It went da 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 da, and as it went da da da, I picked up three coins perfectly. That was so fun. I'm a musical mastermind. I don't even know it. That's good. Oh, -ho. oh, baby, you, you're all that I need. Um, yeah, I guess we double upgrade Sister Maggie, because why not? I'm guessing she just gets more fire rate. Fire off the fires. Good amount of pennies there. I am liking this run. It's got some spice. Tinted rock there. There's a double one. I know that I even need. I didn't realize I don't even need that. I mean, I suppose we get a sack room. That'd be kind of useful. But we're just going to have money coming in so damn quickly everywhere. Okay. Let's get this charged up and ready. Get in there. Slap one of those on you. I, I'm honestly not even focusing on hitting any of the rocks right now. I, I don't know what's going on. I just know that I'm getting damage off and I don't know how. I destroyed one of the, the bomb throwing things somehow. I do not know how. You see? Perfect. I don't know how I managed it, but it went perfectly. And Time Gal is a must take. Time Gal is really good. And we have Soul Hearts back up this way to help us out. We've been to the shop and item room, so we're good. Beautiful. And Mausoleum's next floor, right? Yeah. Sadly, not the floor we have spare Soul Hearts. Let's go there. This has been quite a spicy little boy. Although that's not a phrase that I uh, want to ever repeat again. I apologize to everyone that was involved. It sounded a bit creepy. But yes, what have what have you people been up to during your free time recently? What what, what you been getting up to? What you been doing? It'd be interesting to know. It's always interesting to know. I love uh, I love just chatting with you guys in the comments. By the way, I will just apologise now that um, some of you may have noticed that recently I've been lacking like slacking a little bit on getting back to like replying to comments. Um, I'll take random again. Uh, yes, baby, 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 baby. We got conjoined as well. Uh, some of you may have noticed I've been a little bit slacking, a little bit behind on. Um... Do you know what? Let's play this guy. Come on, dude. Ooh. Yes, please. Suddenly, it is that mo, please, right in front of your face, and I just cannot hide it. Right, that's nice. That's nice. 
Sakura doesn't count as getting hit, so Damocles is still chilling. Okay. Well, yes, uh, what I was going to say is I do apologize to those of you that have noticed that I've been a little bit lacking on replying to comments. Honestly, it's just because the videos are doing well right now. I'm getting a lot more comments than I used to, and it's hard to keep up. I, it's, I Sometimes I don't find time to get to them all, but I, I still do go back, even if I leave it a few days, I still do go back and make sure to reply to every comment. <coughs> and as long as I don't get ridiculously big, which I don't think is going to happen anytime soon, I will always do that. I, I really... Uh, value your guys's comments and i really want to like make sure i'm responding whenever possible this is such an interesting setup that we've got going on right now yeah i always want to make sure that like you guys feel like you're being heard and like that your comments have been seen so uh i am trying to respond even when i don't have the time so much these days i want to make sure to keep that up i think i want that to be like a mainstay of my channel i don't ever want to want to give that up God, time gal, you are so overpowered, it's it's insane. Honestly, the um black hole plus mum's knife is a a combo that's gonna show its true power quite a lot here. Ooh, it's a double tinted rock there. That's that's small rock for us there, baby. Small rock and 120 volt because of Damocles too. Awesome. Does Damocles stay over our head during the uh, the chase sequence? I do not know. But you know what? This is already a bit of a laggy run, and someone suggested it to me in the comments, and I'm going to wholeheartedly take your suggestion and just do this. Give... Is it just knife piece two? C... Six... Seven. Someone suggested it because I wanted a mod that removes the second knife piece chase. As long as it's just doing that. And it's like, yeah. <laughs> the knife, like, it's, it's not particularly the knife piece two, two chase is really hard, which it's, to be fair, it can be. But that's not particularly it. It's more so the case that it just, it takes really, a really long time and it's really laggy. <laughs> Does this door count? Boom. I don't think this counts for Damocles, does it? Right, let's get gone. The sheer amount of uh, money we've been getting here is crazy. But yeah, I'm just going to do that from now on. Someone suggested it. I like the idea. It, it just... There isn't, uh, there isn't a mod that only uh, removes the knife piece two chase. All of them remove both. And I, ah, oh, Damocles is activated. I only want to remove one. I, I, I'm fine with the knife piece one. It's only knife piece two that's really laggy that, that gets me. Really, if there's a room like that where it looks like I could get hit, I should just immediately pop black hole if it's available. It's just so much safer. And with Damocles, it really should have been my first call to action, but... I was not thinking because I am of the stupid persuasion. Adrenaline and the Bible. That seems to be the worst deal I've ever seen in history. Adrenaline's terrible. The Bible's terrible. In fact, both are almost completely useless for me. But yeah, I haven't had a Mum's Knife run in so long, so it feels kind of cr kind of kind of strange, kind of weird to have it. I got feared. Honestly, take a tears down for a damage up. We do not need tears anymore with uh with the apology. Tears is no longer a stat we need to worry about at all. Give me my item room, please. Whip. Ah, I got hit again. It's okay, I'm constantly getting red health back. Because bloody time gal is just throwing crap at me like crazy, so... Don't have to worry in that regard. 
Honestly, deep pocket. Th this is such a crazy combo. Deep pockets plus this thing is just so much money. Not that we even need all the money, but it's just crazy money. Is there only one of you? Oh, there was only one of you. Don't really need to play this golden penny much. By the way, I got a mod that lets you hurt the hosts and stuff while they're invincible. You only deal 10% of your normal damage, so you deal like 90% less damage to them. But it lets you still damage them. So if you have like a bonkers good run, it still lets you hurt them. And it's something I've been looking for for so long. It only just released like today, so... No thank you to both of those. That's a lot of Stevens! Oh my lord. What's going on here? Honestly, all of these are terrible for us. Like, legitimately so terrible. Oh my god. Like, every item we find right now is just bad. I keep thinking they're champions, but they're not. They're just tainted, like, tinted with that, that thing to tell us that they're storing pennies. The hermit, thank you. Is the hermit the one that sells stuff? I can't remember. It's also tarot cloth, so let's check what it actually does. Turns, pickups, and items in the room. Um, spawns one additional penny. Uh, also grants counterfeit penny effect for the room. Okay, nice. God damn, this is crazy. Also in every which way apart from the boss. Oh wait, no, 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 no. I just didn't see that on the map. It was covered by the belt. That's some big ass fires right there. Let's get that set up and ready. Really? You take so long to activate, dude. Way too long. Like, look how long it's been until I can actually hurt this guy. This guy doesn't have a boss health bar either for some reason. Weird. Maybe something to do with him being a modded champion. He doesn't have a health bar at all, so... Bit confused. <laughs> that was a bit weird. Speed upgrade is kind of nice. Don't really need that. Keep it going. We're kind of speeding through here. We are kind of speeding through. One second. Alright, let's keep it going. I, I'm, I'm, the one thing I've been underrating this run, kind of, is the, is the triple knife. The triple knife action from, from uh, what is it, Conjoined, is actually proving to be super useful. Super, super useful. And I was like, I just don't, I, I say this every time, but I just don't get why people don't like it. Why, why do I even use that in this room? I suppose it saves me from getting hit by shots. There's a lot of enemies in this room that can't be dragged, though. Actually, you know what? Kind of worked out. <laughs> Tell me where it is. Where's the item room? It's all I want. It's all I've ever wanted. Grabbing all these pennies. Can't believe we're at 130. I need the, um... Nine lives, not nine lives item, the, the one-up item. that gives you a one-up every 100 coins. It'd be so good as this character. I mean, not that we really need it. Our health is looking pretty tasty already. But, like, also. Familiars have coin tiers. Oh, Lord. There you go. Grab all of that just for, just for having its sake. Oh, that was kind of close. Item room! Where are you? I kind of find it funny that we've got this Keeper's Rope, but also Damocles, so the rope's kind of a line. 
By the way, I do realize this could drop on us at any point and kill us. I know that's a, that's the case at the minute, but I'm I'm playing it as if that doesn't currently exist. Oh my god. That was a crazy split shot there. Also, I'm leaving stuff behind at this point. If you don't like it, soz beef, but honestly, it really doesn't matter to us at this point at all. I should stop getting hit. I am room. Where are you? Child soul. No, 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 no. There it is. We finally got it. Ah, oh, you bastard. <laughs> For some reason, see that coming. Oh, God. Okay, so we definitely want this. And tears you collect. Oh. 7.81 fire rate. That's really good because I don't know if you know this. I didn't know this for a little while. But apparently, um, Mum's Knife, it gives you more damage based on the distance it is away from you. So if you tap fire it, it does like hardly... Well, no, it does good damage, but it does a lot less damage. Tech X. does a lot less damage than it would do... <laughs> oh my lord. Than it would do at full distance, at full charge. I didn't know that for a while. I don't, I don't know if that was changed in Repentance or if it's always been that way, but something that's worth knowing. But yeah, we just got Tech X as well, which is pretty incredible. I think we're on for a pretty good mother run here. There you go. You have been bested, my fair lady. So yeah, like, do actually popping it out the whole way like that is going to do a lot more damage. And now we're turning this guy into gold because everyone has coin tiers. Pretty beautiful. Obviously, this guy still has boss armor, so we're not going to absolutely ravage it, but we're doing pretty good work. There you go. Ah, that was close, that was close. Rotten Heart, good, good. All of you go. And we head on down. Right, I'm just going to take a quick pause and just get down to the next floor for a second. One moment. I am back. I just had to pause because my girlfriend just sent me a message saying she just interviewed uh, David Harbour, the guy that plays Hopper in Stranger Things, with a picture of him. And she just put, just interviewed Hopper, lol. Um, and... It really looks like him. And I'm convinced it's not because she, of how nonchalantly she put lol. It makes me think that she didn't actually. It's just someone that looks really like him. But god damn, it looks really like him. Also, I don't know why he'd be in the UK right now. Uh, but yeah, if that's... I don't, It really does look like him. So if that's true, that's fucking crazy. So I'm like, please reply to me, woman. I want to know. Because <laughs> that's insane. Because we're like in the middle of watching Stranger Things Season 4 right now. Um, so... To have interviewed one of the main actors from Stranger Things would be pretty awesome. She has interviewed a few famous people in her life. Like, she interviewed, um... I can't remember the actor's name now. I, I, I apologise. The guy that played Doctor Who before David Tennant. I cannot remember his name. Um, but she interviewed him. And she interviewed a few other famous people as well. Um, it's just part of what she does in her, in her job. It's kind of... What is, what is going on with our tears right now, by the way? I'm a bit confused at why that keeps happening from time to time. No! <laughs> Damocles got us. We are not on a good winning streak at the minute, but it's it's how it goes. I hope you guys enjoyed this one nonetheless. Kind of a funny ending. Either way, hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next one.